The Artifact was a it was a difficult movie to make, especially for Will. Uh, he was, you know, he was often always running around trying to get teachers. He had lots of problems getting the uh, the actors to come do their parts and everything. More so, it was difficult for him than it was for me. Well, that's it. All over. It is now after nine o'clock on a Thursday night. We're waiting for my mom to pick us up. And uh, tomorrow we're going to put in probably the hardest day's work in history as we do the post-production. It was one hell of a two weeks. Everything that could go wrong did, but we finally got it finished. I mean everything that could go wrong. You wouldn't, you wouldn't believe how many people were just like... The biggest problem, like I said, people getting grounded because of their bad report cards. But there was like, you know, uh, oh, I gotta go to a birthday party or... Uh, don't be a producer. Well, no, be a producer. But don't be a producer in anything involving the school, okay? Because your life will just be difficult. Difficult, difficult, difficult. Everybody, everything that can go wrong does go wrong. People exist, students exist to make producers' lives difficult. And the, pro and the basic problem is everybody has lives. People have jobs. I mean, okay, like Charlotte Jewel can't make it a bunch of days this week because she's modeling. She's modeling. See, the problem is I need to get a bunch of ugly people to be in this. I can't be getting all these beauty queens like, like Lori here, no, Adrian here and all them. No. Oh. And you know, it's just, uh, it's just so stressful. The last couple weeks I've just been wanting to pull my hair out. <laughs> oh well, that's okay, that's okay. No, no problem. I like setting up internet I keep aliases. MCs kind of looking fun. out. Okay, this is going to be four frames long, only 189,000 frames to go. It's like a friggin' gyro... gyroglyphic, man! Uh, do you want this? Or that? Um... Oh, and I think we're gonna screw with this. Where it's gonna be like oh, yeah. that. You can, yeah, next you four can frames, it's gonna be like, 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 like that. And yeah, then I'm gonna cool. have to make a new thing here. Sure, do that. Wow. You're in my goddamn way. Oh man, look, no, you just gotta see that. Like, she's bringing the thing up. Oh, no, almost, oh. almost. Oh, we are so close. It's not even you know, funny. I mean, that should be in her hands, eh? Yeah, look at the beginning part of it. Heck with. Alright, I'll take it frame by frame, see if it's gonna she taking it up. No, not quite enough. That's gonna be a heavy a heavy one. We had we had broke there, because we can't ever we can't ever dine. We'll just have we'll just have her going, I am the leader of the Fall Badlands reunification team! And the school blows up and and yeah. on this movie was the crew, really. I mean, uh, a chance to work with such really great, talented actors and actresses like Matt and Charlotte and Shannon and Brooke and Ashley Sterrett and uh, Will, especially. Will uh, was the, uh, he really held the movie together as a, the writer, the producer. He knew exactly what was going on. Uh, he had everything under control at all times. It was a real, it was a real great experience. Gnosis, Charles P. Allen High School, Miss Valley City, Halifax, etc., etc. Anyway, uh, a lot of you went to Bedford Junior High. You went, a lot of you went there for three years. And a lot of people went through this school, that school, for three years, not noticing that the plaque said Sydney Stephen High School. I find that incredibly appalling. How could you not notice that? I noticed it the second day I was there.